how we doing so this is my second video of the day and I'm gonna go on to do a video about King uh, Kid Cuddy my fault Kid Cuddy and him wearing this dress on Saturday Night Live for uh, for clout all right shaking my head and it's really a uh, disgrace but you know what this ain't the first time this happened or whatever so let me I'll break down a little bit of history of that so they had what people like what Young Thug and a couple other cats doing this stuff. Um, who else? Kevin Hart, uh, Terry Crews. Hey, we could even go back to what Devine Grames and uh, Wesley Snipes back in the day. All right, and of course you know Tyler Perry with his what Medea thing and uh, Martin Lawrence. Okay, I think there was something to laugh at probably back then when guys were going to get on the scene where there was on the way up there was going to make it anyway all right but i just think in this i don't know sensitive culture now and i don't think it's, it's not funny anymore i don't think that it's you know we as black men we need to do that type of stuff now to get roles of clout i mean like kid cuddy everybody knows who he is so i don't know if that was a deal where he had to wear that dress to even get on Saturday Night Live in the first place. But it's kind of like, I don't know. But it, maybe it's a, I don't know, uh, humiliation ritual. Uh, maybe a ritual is where you wear this dress, you get money or whatever, all right? But uh, I just think that's just a degradation to uh, the black man's character. Okay, especially like for a rapper. I'm sorry about the light, y'all. I mean, what's up with these hardcore rappers wearing dresses now, all right? And furthermore, that just tells me like it's some type of agenda going on. So, um, well, it's probably been an the agenda they've been pushing, especially like over the last, let's say three or four years uh, to pretty much uh, denigrate or uh, De demonize or um, the the black man, all right? Uh, de uh, emasculate. That's what I wanted to say. Okay, to show the feminine side of it, all right, in an embarrassing way. So, and there's been other movies about you know men being emas uh, emasculated, but it just seems like more recent uh, more recently it's been people look like me. Okay. Um, I saw a few videos about this, and I think there's they got some pushback on the uh, on this matter, and some of the pushback is not good because, well, whether you like it or not, um, that there are younger people looking up to this, okay? And he does some other type of TV show. I think they deal with kids. Correct me if I'm wrong, okay? So it's kind of like. You, cr you cross that threshold where you'll do stuff, uh, you kind of are the uh, some type of example for the children, whether you like it or not, and then turn around and wear a dress, all right, then what it does is cause confusion. It makes those children want wonder about you. So with your children, come along with the parents, okay? Uh, uh, and not only that, but there's still a lot of brothers, conservative brothers, that is, you know, they ain't rolling with this. So I don't think it's something that needs to be done anymore. I hope that maybe he doesn't really do it anymore, or I don't know, maybe just think twice about it, all right? About some of the, I don't know, the negative uh, pushback that he's gonna get. So, I mean, I hope that our men, you know, we stop, you know, doing stuff like this, okay? I mean, for laughs and kicks and all that stuff. So, all right, we need not do that. All right, and they do warn in, in, in scriptures like Leviticus 20 and 22, you know, not to dress like a man or a woman. Uh, I'm sorry, a woman dressing like a man or a man dressing like a woman, okay? Seems like that's how we get now. We're getting dyslexic in, uh, in the environment now. We're losing moral compass. So that's just my take on it, all right? Um, but 
if you like the video, feel free to subscribe, uh, leave a comments, shares, check out uh, some of the other videos, and uh, stay tuned for the next video.